Hi everybody, Donovan Blasky, Gillen Chevrolet Cadillac here in St. Cloud, Minnesota. Just wanted to take this time out to kind of show you guys this brand new 2022 1500 Silverado LTD. This one here behind me is the RST, which is the Rally Sport truck. That's gonna be our trim level. Um, just wanted to start off showing you kind of the exterior of the truck, some of the features and benefits there. Um, we do have a little bit aggressive tires here. That'll give you more of that aggressive feel on the road. Um, when it comes to the truck bed itself, this one here is going to be the short box. That's going to be five and three quarters of an inch. Um, obviously, we do have some bed assist steps here on the side. This one comes with Chevy Tech spray and bed liner. That's going to be a GM thing. You can always go with an aftermarket spray and bed liner. This one comes from the factory. Everything that's on a hinge with the new body style going from 2018 to 2019 is made out of aluminum. So even though this has the slow drop down tailgate, it is going to be a lot lighter than all of its predecessors. Coming over to the passenger side here, with Silverado, the blind spot monitor is available. This one in particular does not come with that one as a standard. But again, you're kind of looking at the easy access to get into the vehicle utilizing the buttons on the handle. We'll dive into that a little bit more here in just a moment. But I wanted to show you guys something on the front of the truck. So if you take a look here at the front of the truck, with the RST, this one here has the 6.2 liter V8, and that's paired with a 10-speed automatic transmission. That's going to give us a max towing capacity of 9,100 pounds. If you look at the sleek design with the black bow tie, painted bumpers, you get the black recovery hooks. The, one of the things I like to point out are these air curtains on the side. This improves aerodynamics and helps with your fuel economy and it reduces drag as well. Because it's more so guiding the air around the wheel well rather than throwing it into the wheel well. So let's go ahead and dive into the interior of the truck and let me show you some of the features and benefits there. So going over some of the interior stuff, I want to start with the back seat here. Um, if you could step up, take a look here. I'll go to the other side to kind of show everything. Interior-wise, this one here does come with the leather package. These seats here will fold up to give you some additional storage in the RST. Uh, you do have the little bit of storage underneath here. That's good for something like, you know, if you have a rifle, you're going hunting, um, fishing rod, maybe even a pool cue. You might have to have it in half, but um, this one will also have your GM floor liners. That's a built specifically by the VIN for General Motors here. We also have some additional space behind the seat here. There's a little bit of additional space there for something like say your jumper cables or if you're going out camping, maybe a box of popcorn or something like that. And also obviously your fold down cup holders there as well. Continuing on with the interior of the truck, I'd like to give you the opportunity to get the full driver experience. So I'll have you go ahead and hop in and I'll show you all of the features and benefits interior. Heated steering wheel, that'll be a benefit for those cold Midwestern months. Um, or if you just need to have some hot hands for that drive period. Over here, I've got your Bluetooth connectivity settings. This will actually answer your call and it, you'll be able to press and hold to do any voice commands. And this is to hang up the phone. Otherwise, you can also utilize this to mute the sound. Say somebody in the back seat is saying something, you can't hear them over the radio. You can actually use that to temporarily turn that sound off. Your dial here is going to go through your driver information center that's going to be located on the dashboard here. This will give you statistics such as things like your fuel economy for this trip, your oil pressure, um, your fuel range, as well as your PSI for all of your tires around the truck itself. It's also going to give you your air, fil your air filter and brake pad life as well. Your tow haul mode, once you get it into tow haul mode with your dial here, you can actually utilize the plus minus here to upshift and downshift in any event that you are towing. Behind here on the steering wheel on the back side of the right hand side, that's going to be for your volume for the infotainment system. Let's go over the center console a little bit, huh? So here with the center console, just wanted to go over a few of the features here. You do have dual climate control. So if husband's driving, doesn't want it so hot, you can turn that down to 67, let's say. And I don't know about you, but my wife is a freeze baby, so she'd probably keep it up right around that 88. Uh, down here, you're gonna have your downhill cruise control assist. This is your automatic release for your lift gate on the back, hazard lights here. You can turn your traction control on and off in case you're doing any off-roading and stuff like that. And then you also have 
this button here which actually activates any electricity to that outlet here on the console <clears throat> trailer brake controller as well as your USB-C USB and your AC adapter up top here on the infotainment one of my favorite things about the new Silverados you do have the option to do a direct tune say there's an exact radio station that you like listening to you can actually tune right to that station setting your presets is as simple as pressing and holding which is pretty convenient anytime you're trying to set your radio when you're on the road if you're up north in an area that you don't aren't familiar with the radio stations you can actually click browse and it'll do a little search for you in that area and show you all available radio stations that you do have signal for a lot of other things you can do in here such as apple carplay android auto the trailering will actually do a trailer light test for you that'll go through and check all your trailer brake lights your turn lights and if there is any connection errors it'll actually show you where that connection error is which kind of speeds up that process if you're doing any trailer and you don't have to have a person behind you saying hey this light works that light doesn't and so on and so forth a couple other things in the setting menu this is where you can actually customize the vehicle how you would like it you can have it where the rear seat reminder will or will not go off depending on how you would like that configured anytime the back doors get open it will give you a reminder once you're done with that drive cycle and turn the truck off this is a benefit if you leave, say, a purse or your child in the back seat. Uh, moving forward, a couple of things here. This is the RST with the center console. So you do have a very, very deep weld storage compartment here that's gonna have an additional USB-C, USB, and auxiliary with the spot to put a micro disc as well. And the new Silverados, in case you didn't notice, I'll go ahead and show you now. This is actually gonna be a push to start. All you got to do is push on the brake, press the button to fire it up, and then when you're done with the drive cycle, you just go ahead and power that off. Key fob is just going to be a fob. This is a proximity-based fob. You're going to have your lock, unlock, remote start, and then your release for the tailgate as well as your panic button. Another thing in regards to the remote start, utilizing any of the OnStar connected services, this truck itself does come with one year of OnStar remote access due to the fact that it is retrofitted for the heated seats which will be here one for the seat bottom and the back and one for just the seat bottom however utilizing the onstar connected services your onstar button will be here with your right next to your sos button onstar connected services will give you things like again the remote access which gets you the ability to lock unlock start and check vehicle diagnostics right from the my chevrolet app on your phone so as long as you have cell reception and the truck is connected you'll be able to utilize all of those features. With other packages, you also have things like emergency crash response, roadside assistance. Well, folks, that about wraps it up. I hope you enjoyed the presentation of the 2022 Silverado LTD. And another quick thing, uh, just to give you that little bit of peace of mind, as with all Chevrolet products, we do offer the three-year, 36,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty, and also the five-year, 60,000 miles on the powertrain. Again, my name is Donovan Belaski with Gilliland Chevrolet Cadillac here in St. Cloud, and hope to see you soon.